All right, so this is 2.80. It says, assume that you encounter the following sentences in your reading. What is the chemical formula for each substance mentioned? Sodium hydrogen carbonate is used as a deodorant. So sodium hydrogen carbonate would be Na. And then hydrogen carbonate is HCl3. If you don't know what the polyatomic ion is, you'll have to look it up on the back. So hydrogen carbonate has a negative one charge, and sodium is plus one, so that's the formula. Letter B, calcium hypochlorite is used in some bleaching solutions. So calcium is CA. And then hypochlorite, you can look that up on the back of the periodic table here, and hypochlorite is CLO negative 1, CLO with a negative 1 charge. Calcium, when you look it up on the periodic table, is in group 2, so it's positive 2. So you have a positive 2 and a negative 1 species there, so make sure that when you combine them, there's 2 of the hypochlorite species of the negative one pieces to match the positive two uh, of calcium. Letter C, hydrogen cyanide is a very poisonous gas. So that's hydrogen. And then cyanide is just a polyatomic ion, that's CN. If you look it up on the back here, you'll find out that cyanide's negative one and hydrogen's positive one. So that's the formula. Letter D, Magnesium hydroxide is used as a cathartic. So magnesium hydroxide would be Mg. And then hydroxide is OH. And you memorized hydroxide is negative 1. And if you look on the front, here's magnesium. It's in the group 2, so it's positive 2. So when I write the formula for it, it would be Mg, don't forget the parentheses, OH2, two of those. And then letter E, tin 2 fluoride has been used as a fluoride additive in toothpaste. So tin 2 fluoride would be SN, and since it says 2, that means it's positive 2. And then fluoride would be F, that would be negative 1. So that means it's SNF2 as tin 2 fluoride. So you have two fluorides for every one tin. And then letter F, when cadmium sulfide is treated with sulfuric acid, fumes of hydrogen sulfide are given off. So there's two of them actually that are right there. Cadmium sulfide is the first one. So if you don't have this on your periodic table yet, cadmium is always plus two, so you can put that down. And it's cadmium sulfide. And sulfide just means it's the element sulfur, which is minus two almost all the time when it's with a metal. So there's cadmium sulfide. And then it says, it's mixed with sulfuric acid, which is H2SO4. And then hydrogen sulfide fumes are given off. So hydrogen sulfide would be hydrogen with sulfur. Hydrogen's in group one, so it's plus one. Sulfur's in the oxygen group, so it's minus two. So make sure that you have H2S. That's number 80.